Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting between two episodes three and four of Arco Trip. Yes, I know today episode five is currently out. I am downloading episode five as we speak, but due to this woman sending me all this stuff, um, due to it being a little bit a hot behind minute, I'm gonna go ahead and watch three and four now. Then probably by the time I've done five, should already be done downloading. Then I'll watch five and then. Trying to catch up on all of this other stuff because I gotta do this too mother effing day. And it's already 1.51 and I'm a little stressed right now. But other than that, it's gotta get started in three, two, one, go. Well, in a way, he already did because she walked by them and got one. So really more or less, it was just like a picture. I don't want to mess with this. Like... <laughs> honestly missed this show the last three weeks like trying to catch up on so many things and such because once again hurricane no one but two everything else ish like oh my freaking god these last couple of weeks of my birthday month have been super freaking annoying but i need to catch up because another thing is happening in my life i am moving soon so i gotta start packing and everything so a goal is trying to maybe get like my figures and such packed today um and then do a little bit here and there like as much as i can between going to work and then doing second job when i come home Oh. Well, who's going out in that? Oh! Are you okay? I mean, might as well just stay inside. Okay, then go with her. That's oh, cool. You have at the mall.
No, now is not the time. You're, he's basically like a manager in a way. I'm with Jenga. Oh, that's cool. Right? Oh, we're going to work on something together, all right.
<laughs> well, because he lives there. <laughs> Oh my god, she's a Right? So... He's so freaking cute. Oh my god. Aww. Well, we're not getting that phone call answered.
que hay. All ends well in a weird way. I mean, okay, so let's talk about this episode. This is a really cute episode. I love the fact that, one, it was a storm for the first half, and Barry and her, you know, mascot, they couldn't do anything due to the fact it's like, boom, she gets hit with a freaking trash can of all things. And she's like, oh, it takes care of her for an episode, which is really sweet. Like, oh my god. I think that's like every magical girl fan dream, like literally to take care of the magical girl that they're secretly obsessed with and such. And so I love how she's just like, so like, I gotta take care of her, but oh my God, she looks so cute sleeping. Oh my God, she's sleeping about, she's dreaming about pancakes. I want to make her pancakes. Like, oh, oh my God. Girl. And then the next day, I love how, the fact that the cat was like, okay. Let me go ahead and give her a thank you gift. Let me return, give her something nice and such. And then next thing you know, gets caught. <laughs> In a weird way. You gotta feel bad for him though. But he didn't know that was gonna happen. I don't think any of us knew that was gonna happen up until, you know, yes, Chrome comes in with the jump rope. Out of all things, the jump rope. I thought he would have had actual rope. <laughs> She's like, oh. She's a cold grandmother coming home like it's a normal Tuesday. <laughs> oh crap. It was hilarious.
Got a wrist for that shot. His voice seems familiar. Like, I I've definitely heard his voice in something else. Is uploading speed? Ah. Uh. I know that's right. <laughs> but no, he's so, okay. He's so freaking adorable. I love the determination he has to like literally get all the videos out of Barry like uber much because that's like me with my videos because with everything going on in my life whether it's good bad and different whatever and then me being stressed as hell and trying to hurry up and get a video out before the day is over or before my day is over oh my god because like okay for for an example okay this week i have to i think on fr uh, friday and saturday i have to close the store um like i used to at ups let me tell you, when I come home, I am tired. I am tired than tired. Um, imagine, like, okay, mind you, my job, <clears throat> I am standing for hours on end. And I'm walking around and such. You know how, like, when your legs lock up into place after standing for a certain amount of hours and such? That's what my legs feel like by the time I get off of work and I'm on my way home and I'm just now, like, sitting in the car and such. Um... And everything and then I have to come home I'm laying down and I'm like I gotta get stuff done and then 9 out of 10 I don't end up doing it until like whatever and the next thing you know I'm like stressed because I'm so freaking behind <laughs> because that's how I currently feel now okay oh, oh! <laughs> that sounds nothing what no actually funny enough If I really, that is hilarious. I, I never would have thought that the cat would be played by Yen from Dr. Sh <laughs> and, and I should have realized it after episode one and two, but I didn't because I'm like, oh, he's so freaking cute because, you know, he barely really had like a moment um, to talk. But no, oh, he's so freaking cute. Like, oh my God, precious baby boy. We love him. He's the best cameraman regardless. But no, this is a really good episode. But go ahead and pause the video. And I will see you guys in one second for episode four. Funny enough, literally just got a notification saying episode five is done downloading. But like I said, we're doing four and five right now. And I mean, not four and five, three and four. And then you'll get five. But I'll see you in a second for episode four. Okay, episode four in three, two, one, go. He eating his dinner. <laughs> Well, I like the fact that they're showing that situation from episode one again.
It's okay, Chrome. You're going to be in a better house in a couple of minutes. It's okay. Grown-ups can cry. I cry way too much. There's your saving grace. I do love the fact that we got to see that. I mean, because remember, between episode one and episode two, really more or less episode two, we got to really just see him talk about it and, like, show how he met Chizuko's um, grandfather and such. But to have an episode for the first, like, four minutes literally showing, okay, here's the situation of episode one all again, but in a different POV and such. That's really nice. I hope we get another one like that. Oh, baby, that wasn't a nightmare. It's too late, honey. Baby Capybara, this is so cute.
Where is he? Not really, honey. Crown. But she doesn't want that. Right. And, and I mean, we might as well just continue this mess. Seriously? Well, I mean, what the hell? I mean, she has, she wants to see Barry, you know, let her do what she's got to do to see her, duh.
I mean, she's just picking up trash. Like a jellyfish. Oh, water fish. Nice. Aren't those sea urchins? No. Yes. Uh, 
a ver. Right? Like, everybody got hurt. You could have got hurt, too. Few days. Hold on. A few days with Thunderbolt. <laughs> Maybe she's going to the class. She's just like laying her head down and you just see her shaking. <laughs> oh my god, you feel so bad for her. You're like, come here, it's gonna be it's gonna be alright. Like, oh my god, no, it's okay. But like, oh my god. The fact that Chrome he was like, oh, I have a high resistance to it, like, because you know, he's dealt with it for so long, but then like he's at work and he's <laughs> he's crashing out as well. Oh my god. But Ooh, excuse me. I will say in a way you feel bad for all three of them because like, okay, for Chizuko, number one, if Barry and Chrome didn't go back into work, one, we already saw that like her life would have been back to <clears throat> essentially a normal life and that's what she doesn't want. She likes excitement. She likes something out of the ordinary that is very much different for her and not to have a mundane, basic, everyday, normal ass life. I don't think a lot of people want that and such. For um, Barry, Barry had to go be a volunteer girl. Homegirl was doing volunteering every single freaking day. It had no time for Magical Girl esque. And Chrome, Chrome is Chrome. Toughness. What, what type of club is this?
I would be dead after that. Because you went to go work out. Poor baby. Oh. Oh, I know that feeling. I know that feeling. Like, okay. I haven't worked out in like a hot ass minute, but like, okay. My my thing is with my new job, I'm I'm walking around like nonstop and such. I, I'm running around, walking around, whatever. I am now essentially hitting my 10k steps with it almost every single time I go to work, depending on what time I go. Um which is nuts, but like every single time when I come home or even the next day, I am so freaking stiff. And the worst thing is nine out of 10, I have to go back to work the next freaking day. And it hurts oh so much. Even when you take like a really good shower and stuff, like I, like my left foot, um, with the shoes that I wear, uh, like kind of locks into place after maybe about five hours and such. And so I literally have to like stretch my foot in order for me to hurt. Like, they're, they're good clog uh, nursing shoes where I don't feel essentially the pain until I take them off and such. And so I love them oh so much. But at the same time, like, girl, man, being on your feet for so many hours long and not only getting 30 minutes to sit down is still... It's still nuts, but the pay is good. That's what I look at. I look at the pay very, very well. But no, this is a cute little freaking episode. Both episodes, honestly, were really cute in their own special way. But I am excited to see what the heck episode 5 is really going to lead into. So, of course, obviously, we'll watch that in a few. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction between episodes 3 and 4 of um, Arco Trip. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys soon-ish before the day is over for episode five. Until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye!